Привіт, привіт. Привіт усім. Today we are going to talk about a topic that last week we saw an article on Facebook talking about why Taiwanese men's boys were not so appropriate. Bad looking style. <laughs> the article says and to to uh, translate in English kind of like cheesy, tacky, not so appropriate. But I think it's not about this because we know, of course, Taiwan have some people like everywhere who have style, who take care of appearance. But yes, we do realize there's some guys that doesn't care so much. So how do you think, Daniel? Uh, I used to live in Taiwan one year since 2011 to 2012. So I think I have my own opinion. I was surprised that you guys wear slippers yes. everywhere. Almost. Like well, not like, everywhere. And it doesn't matter what season outside. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> winter, summer, nobody care. You can wear a winter jacket on the top and flips up on, on the bottom. It looks so bad and I just want to know why. Okay. First of all, we don't have really big season different like yours. We our winter is not so cold, so we get used to wear slippers when we go somewhere around our house. Maybe some people get more further. I don't know, but we are come from a country, a city. We have a lot of convenience stores. And it could be supermarket or convenience store just right down of your apartment. So if we come home, we change to what we wear at home. And if you want to buy something, we will go down in a short, in a t-shirt, in a slippers, flip up for sure. That there's no reason to change to shoes again to go out just for three minutes. But I saw some students wear slippers to university yes okay three years ago maybe we were in Fengjia Dashue Fujing the breakfast shop they wear slippers to university yeah we cannot wear slippers to university because they live so close to the campus so they just go downstairs and go to class Yes, it is true. And especially for those guys, they don't care their appearance so much. Shorts, t-shirt, even slippers go to a classroom. In Ukraine? Everything opposite. I was student, it doesn't matter. Uh, students, uh, young generation, old generation, all, all of them care about their appearance too much. And uh, some students wear suit and tights to university. I will show them this uh, <laughs> Zelensky he teach in high school and people wear suit. And yeah. Okay, what yeah, else? So Number one, uh, slippers. Number two, people wear pajamas to supermarket, to yeah. some uh, coffee shop. It sounds like you don't care how do you look. It's uh, like we just go into the kitchen. But yeah, but the with other the other thousand the people can watch you. Yeah, I, I try to like find out the reason. I think this is just because too convenient. So we don't care. In this article, they also say that Taiwanese boys, I don't know about girls, they don't care too much. Those people who passing by, we don't care. Yeah, we don't watch, we don't care. So that's why they also don't care how the other think. Could be true, yes. Like I, if I walk on the street, I don't care so much the other people Ukrainian, wear. Ukrainian girls do some basic makeup before supermarket. <laughs> this is a Japanese girl who just moved to Taiwan. I just saw a video from Buyang Now Studio. That she say, I feel here so comfortable that I w can wear slippers and t-shirts. I understand her because even I have changed. And without makeup go out and it's yes. okay. But in Japan, she, if she do like this, then it will be very impolite, appropriate for the others. So, also because we don't have a good like beauty education, that we don't have good fashion. Like I grew up with this hand tan, Giordano, net, 
These are like just clothes shop, but not even a style. Nothing and about fashion. Nothing about fashion. Nothing about style. And now we have okay, Zara, H M N. A little be more stylish. Uniqlo. This article also say even the same shop, in the other country compared to Taiwan. Our window display kind of weird. So why is the same brand but we have two different standards? I don't know. Maybe Japan's Uniqlo more stylish. I don't know. It's about guys' fashion, but how about girls? I remember 10 years ago, I like everything in Taiwan. Every shop, I want some dress, I want some uh, pants, we have and more I bought shops a lot. For girls. Yes, for sure. But I think that in Taiwan, they think about. How cute it is! More than yeah. And in Ukraine, girls before they buy clothes, they think, is it attractive enough? Enough? Is it sexy enough? Yes. Okay. This is Basically, the difference Ukrainian between Ukrainian women think just like kind how of to old, attract kind of old-fashioned, real feminine style. Yeah. Girls, long hair, full makeup, high heels, dress. This is what their standard for a woman should look like. Mm -hmm. In Asia, Taiwan, we have a lot of Japanese and Korean culture, so it could be more cute style with fringe, with glasses, uh, accessories. And for American, they could be like, okay, we want to be not so feminine, we want to be sto sportive, we want to be unisex style. Oh, unisex. Like you cannot tell, yeah, like jean style, where everything yoga pants and tank tops. So every region have their standard of beauty. I don't want them to think that in Ukraine they will see only sexy girls on the high heels and dress. You've been. Four times in Ukraine, so no, what is your okay. opinion? What is your mm. things? You cannot what see you sloppy Ukrainian girl outside. Okay, there's no sleeper and big t-shirt and without makeup, bad hairstyle. Ukrainian girl walking on the street. But in Asia, maybe you will see. Okay, for guys, well, Ukrainian guys <laughs> actually have a weird um, taste nice. of. I would say Europe, West Europe, like French, Italian, I don't know, Spanish, they have more sense of clothing. But Ukrainian, they are still very sportive, I would say sportive. Most of the time they wear something like sport, football. And they're afraid to be feminine looking. There's no way that they will like, be Like, for example, unisex. if you wear a scarf yeah. this style, for them it's maybe too much. Yeah. Or some, I don't know. Nothing about unisex. Yeah. <laughs> They're still very tough inside. And yeah, yeah. To be huh, I'm a man here. Sportive. Who is a man here? Just, yeah. And we, ha we also have some weird style. Oh, like yes. uh, in the small cities, guys. Yes. For example, nightclub, they wear everything white white shirt, white pants, and even white shoes. <laughs> Tacky style. Yeah. But I think, okay, everything will change very fast since we have internet. So you watch uh, Instagram or something, then you, Pinterest, you start you're to learn by the new style very fast. Yeah. So I think it's maybe true. after five years, everyone will be more neutral, will be more like not so strong. Style anymore. Like in Ukraine now, very popular kimono, Japanese kimono. Yeah, okay, so yeah. Ukrainian designer have... went to Japan, they was inspired by Japanese fashion yeah. and they mix with the Ukrainian uh, print and it looks very good. I want to show you something. This is my team in Taiwan called Luxie Boys and we work with one designer start from 10 years ago and every time they have some show they will ask him for help and he's doing very good job so wonderful job that many artists use his dress to go on the magazine shooting and the red carpet his name is Aguo Bob so I will show you this photo and just finished this Taipei Fashion Week a few, few days, days ago. ago so it's not doesn't mean that Taiwanese don't have sense, of course we have some really good style people but just in general, some of us at some point of time 
<laughs> will wear pajama and slipper at the same time. Go to the supermarket. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's the conclusion. So, if you want to date with some foreigner girls, you should care more. What do we wear? Doesn't okay, matter what so nationality. Make sure you have a good, good looking. Appearance. Yeah. Not dirty shoes, nice pants, not short, not okay. Unless you know this girl very well, yeah. If it's like sportive style, if not, just try to dress well. And uh, don't spend too much time on your hairstyle. If you have too much spray, it's also not not so good, for my opinion. I feel uncomfortable when I see his hairstyle better than mine. How many hours he spent? You understand? This is not so important. This is this is my my opinion. Yeah. So for <laughs> Ukrainian girl, you just need to have a better better spend more time on your body shape. With muscle. <laughs> yeah. Like, like like Bambi. Yeah. We're Tell so us. happy. We have ten thousand subscribers. Yeah. <laughs> if you think this is interesting video and make sure you leave a comment yeah we can talk more about how you think why they yeah. say Taiwanese boys don't care and of course I know someone really care but why this happened like we saw people working on working on sleep I work on <laughs> sleepers go to the supermarket yes I yeah I don't wear shoes see you next video bye 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 Uh, I cannot finish my <laughs> <laughs>